What's up guys, Don the 605 here and welcome back to another tutorial video. I make uh, PS4 videos throughout Sh Share Factory and I'm gonna show you guys how to make awesome videos just like I do. What's up guys, Don the 605 here and welcome back to another ed tutorial. Today we're showing you guys how to edit on PS4. Now this has actually been a requested video and in the community and uh i'm here to show you guys how to do that it's, well first off w what you want to actually do is actually go to new project to start a video yeah it doesn't matter what uh i for preference uh you can choose any uh um well let's say any theme you want this can also change some of the music and that uh, some of it doesn't actually require the license to use and some music and some of the uh, themes actually have other intros, outros, stickers, whatnot. Yeah, but for this one, we're just gonna go with the old Last of Us one. Hey, there's Morgan. <laughs> what are you doing? You get in the Last of Us. So basically, the intro. Uh, doesn't matter. I usually don't use an intro, but if you want to, you can do that, but I'm not going to do it. So, essentially we're going to do a clip here. Well, yeah, we'll do a clip here. Press swear. You can rename the project if you want, but we're just going to leave it there for now because we're not doing publishing this video as is. So in order to start, you want to press X. You'll see a whole bunch of things appear. And to add a track, or such as face cam, hello, uh, you want to actually press add track too. Now, um, I don't know. Now, in order to actually pan and zoom in the, uh, uh, track 2 thing, you want to actually press triangle, then square, then uh, pan and zoom, and then move it as freely. Uh, I don't want to the green screen in PS4 because it could be a little finicky at times. And, uh, yeah. Now when you go back to the main track, track 1, press uh, at square, and then you'll see these other things. Split clip. Now this is very crucial to remember how to do. If you don't know how to do this, you're not going to know how to edit a lot of clips. I've used this thing more times than most of my other videos. Um, Paint and Zoom, I think, is just for like fun editing stuff, I guess. If I'm uh, just looking at something, I don't know, for you guys to see. Time Bender is just for fun, I guess. Or if I see something that's too fast to see normally, I just slow it down. Um, trim, I can trim down the clip if I if I see something explicit I can remove it with that or if I could, I could just do the same with clipping it wouldn't matter anyways but it would sometimes it would be a little too short and then I'd have to trim it anyways but you know uh, it, it sometimes has it, it's finicky problems issues move clip essentially what that does is it does what it does moves the clip except I only had two clips to do that music now this is uh, important to know because not all music is in, uh, available to YouTube as uh, to mute, but personally I don't know. So um, let's see uh, overlays. These are like uh, basically why what some people don't know is the camera effects are actually effects on your camera. Let's take focus for example. That's what it does. You can also change the settings by going to press square and then go into camera duration. You can make it go as long as you want. You can make it go longer. Or a little fun trick I like to do is when it gets to a certain point it when you split a clip in between uh, the the in 
move in and move out of the uh, focus, it the splitting of the clips st cancels out the animation of the uh, it interrupts the focus animation. Now there's some other things we could do. To actually remove clips, you want to actually press X, and then if you want to remove the clip heat from, if you want to remove this clip over here, you press square over here, or if you want to remove this clip, you press square over here. Now whatever you hover over after clipping two clips whatever you hover over it's the gone last few minutes of it. and uh... alright so now that with that one's out of the way hmm. you can also uh... add filters so this is actually essentially what I know some things you can do Colorize, but did you know that the colorize has filter settings to change the color? Oh, yeah, and an add trick too, you can also, uh add clips, record audio without face cam or with face cam, but two of those features require uh, a um, a camera well I don't know but yeah uh, but also add transitions um, this one's another one of my editing tickets. Now, KJRA60, uh, uh, wait, so, uh, I don't know how to say his name. He, like, he's, this, this dude with 6 million subscribers, I don't know if he actually had that channel, but, see, someone told me that you have to actually, uh, you have to actually, people, well, not that you had to, you had to actually, uh, alright, I can't talk over myself, thank you. Freaking volume. You're out. Alright, but basically you can also apply, uh, um, the, all apply to all by pressing square and then press X to confirm. And that would also, that would mute every, that would apply the changes to everything. But... Essentially, this is a test video uh, on the uh, uh, a test project. It's not really a video I'm going to be publishing anytime soon. You know, I probably already was going to do a video on on Char Four, but it didn't matter. I didn't do it. So this is kind of essentially one of those teasers to a lost video. Except it's not really a video. The video I did. It's a uh, I don't know. So we also have cinematic. Oh yes, explosion. This is a one that a lot of people ask me about a lot. So in order to get an uh, explosion, you have to actually go to transmission, go to cinematic, and explosion. To add some fun on top of that. So I want to say that to edit your overlays, you want to go over here. This essentially right here, this black line right here, shows a transition line where your cinematic uh, transition applies to, or how long it lasts. And 
and uh, yeah, you can also edit transmissions and by changes, you know, the settings that support it. And the fun thing is, you can actually uh, pan and zoom on certain clips that you split. And that's about it. <laughs> hmm. And that's, uh, that's one thing I got. It's amazing what you could do within 10 minutes of a video. And... Now let's see what happens when I actually get a video running in official. Freaking Ghostbusters, are you kidding me? <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, yes. It's amazing what you can actually do in 10 minutes of a video. But that's, uh, that's me and, uh, editing.